basic parameters. Now we're going to go over the parameters inside the takeoff screen. They are different for each fitting, of course, depending on the shape and size and complexity of the fitting and what type of accessories you would use. We will walk you through the basics. First, you will notice you can just change parameters by typing the number you want and clicking the down arrow. If you would like to use the Enter to complete a field, you need to go into My Libraries, go down to Preferences, and then check Use Enter to complete a field. Now I will not have to use the down arrow to change fields. Here I'm going to put in, on the same fitting as before, a new length, and now I'm going to click enter as I change through the fields. After our numeric parameters, we have an option to put a system number attached to this fitting, which we can automatically be placed on the label if you'd like. I will label this one 1, 2, 3, 4. You will also notice you have an option for piece numbering, which can be automatically switched by clicking on automatic piece numbering. If that box is checked, you will notice as I go through fittings, you will see piece number one. Now I'm going to burn, select another fitting, and Practicam will automatically label it piece number two. By turning this option on or off, it will make things simpler as you run through multiple fittings inside Practicam. 